Well, you may have recently heard some storms called a bomb cyclone, and believe it or not, it's actually a meteorological term. But what does this mean? Let's break it down. We first have to start by going over some important background. Most of our weather is driven by differences in pressure. Areas of similar pressure are called high pressure and low pressure systems. In a high pressure system, winds move clockwise around an area of high pressure. Descending air from the upper atmosphere reduces cloud formation and typically results in calm weather. Regions within this system experience no major temperature changes. The qualities of a low pressure system are the exact opposite. Winds circulate counterclockwise and temperature changes within the system drive storms, rain and other forms of precipitation. These temperature changes can also decrease the system's overall pressure, intensifying wind speeds. Some of the most significant temperature changes are seen in the mid-latitudes. Warm air influenced by tropical sea surface temperatures interact with cold air from the north, causing a dramatic pressure drop. When the pressure drops by at least 24 millibars within 24 hours, the low pressure system is classified as a bomb cyclone. Bomb cyclones occur between fall and spring when temperature differences are most pronounced. This rapid pressure drop can lead to extreme winds and powerful storms. Researchers coined the term bomb cyclone to describe the meteorological process of bombogenesis, which covers the rapid intensification of a system. With your Weather IQ, I'm meteorologist David Guerrero.